you didn't see, um, first thing, I got my nails done today. And if you're wondering why, why did you get your nails done? <laughs> Good question. Um, it's because doo, 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 this weekend, this weekend, this weekend, this weekend is my Taylor Swift concert. Let's fucking go. Um, so I'm going to the Eras tour. So you'll be seeing this. You'll be seeing this the day, the day before I go, which is very exciting. Um, I'm so excited. This will be my, this will be my fourth time seeing Taylor in concert. Um, I haven't gone to this air store yet. I haven't gone to the air store yet, in case you were wondering. But um, I, I first saw Taylor on the Red, the Red tour back in 2013. This was back when I was in high school, and then I saw her on the 1989 tour in San Diego, and then I saw her in on the Reputation tour. Was the last time that I saw her, and it was five years ago. Um, and you know, obviously, obviously, this channel is called Wildest Dreams ASMR because it's named after Taylor Swift. You know, this song, Wildest Dreams, Wildest Dreams, 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 Dreams. Um, so safe to say, I could not be more excited about this era tour. And and the best part about me going to this era tour is that me and my sister, we got third. It's crazy to even say out loud because, uh, you know, I've been a diehard Taylor Swift fan ever since I was 13 years old, and I've never sat close to the stage, like nowhere near close to the stage, um, and so it's going to be an experience. It's going to be life-changing, 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 and I could not be more excited. Like, every time I think about it, I get, like, butterflies up my whole body, uh, but anyways, I got this in the mail recently. VIP, the VIP, the v VIP, VIP, VIP box. So I thought I would do an unboxing, an unboxing with you because, uh, you know, this is my very first ever VIP experience at a Taylor Swift concert. Like, oh my god, I can't believe we got so lucky. We got our tickets last November. So we've been waiting for this concert for like eight or nine months now. It's been a long time. these pictures if you're new here if you're not a Taylor Swift fan and you have no idea these are all her 10 different eras so we have all of them around the sides here and then we have Midnight's Midnight's it's in the middle Midnight's is her most recent era you'll have to let me know if you are a Taylor Swift fan which era is your favorite my uh, well okay I'm gonna be going to the concert with Reputation Vibes because my outfit is going to be like reputation and I'm so excited about it um, but me personally as a Taylor Swift fan um, my personal top three favorite albums are reputation midnights and evermore those are my three those are my my top I always say this, I always 
I say this, but I think Reputation is not my favorite album, but it's my favorite era, you know? Like, I live, I live, I live, 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 live for the bad bitch energy. Oh, like, I am here for that. You know, I'm here for that. Um, but music-wise, music-wise, I think my favorite albums are either Evermore or Midnight's, which is crazy, right? Because those are like two of her most recent. I swear, she just keeps getting better and better. Every album. Anyways, okay. First things first. Wow. Look at this. Um, so this is a poster specifically for our city, Seattle. Um, when you get these VIP packages for every city in America, the posters are different for every city. And so this is the poster for Seattle. Like, <laughs> like dude, we fucking won, okay? We fucking won. Look at this. This is stunning. This is beautiful. Oh my god. So, I'm just gonna do some light, light tapping, light tapping. You know, after getting this poster too, I realized that our concert weekend is the anniversary of folklore. So like, uh, we're probably gonna get a beautiful like folklore moment. Maybe some secret songs from folklore. I don't know. I am hoping for peace. Oh my god, I love peace so much. Can you believe how cute? Like all these little fireflies. Like, all these little fireflies, and then this beautiful. Wow. See, I love, love this. I'm probably gonna try to find a frame to hang this on the wall. I mean, I might just put it up, like in my room, just like this. But I also, I think maybe, maybe I should get a frame for it. I don't know. And then there's also this one. Ah, so cute. Oh my god. These are gonna look so cute up on my wall. I don't know if these are making good sounds or not. Like, is this pleasant for you? Or is it terrible? <laughs> I don't know, but anyways, there's a couple different posters in here. Okay, there's this one. <gasps> Ooh. This one is very cute. Not as cute as the others though, in my opinion, but these ones are cool because again, though that we have some posters that are like this way and then we have some that are like you know more landscape and then the last poster is this one which this one is interesting so those are all the four different posters and then we have this um this is actually the uh this is the pocket that the posters came in but i took all this nice oh, like, I feel like this is just another poster you know like, this is another poster we did so sister is dressing up with like lover vibes she got these like pink sparkly boots it's gonna be so cute i love that we decided to go for like the sister albums you know because i think the sister albums in my mind it's reputation and lover and then evermore and folklore like those are the sister albums and i'm so excited that we chose the sister albums because i'm gonna be reputation she's gonna be lover it's gonna be so cute. If you're not following me on Instagram, on my Instagram, my Instagram is at underscore my fictional world. I'm probably gonna be posting a lot of stuff in my Instagram stories tomorrow night while I'm there. So if you want to see all of my updates, I would definitely recommend following me over there. This is cool. Let me show you this. So this is a tote bag that comes.
comes in the box. How freaking cute is this? Oh my god, how cute. So it's actually, it's a pretty good, pretty good sized tote bag here. We have the um, eras. The eras are all here. And then on the back, on the back. <gasps> Ooh, look at how cool it is. So these are all of the cities, at least in the states that she's been playing in. And then we have all 10 of the eras listed. Oh, isn't that so cute? Isn't that so cute? like a bunch of little like playing cards like i thought for a second for a second i was like oh my god how cute like this is gonna be like a little deck of cards <laughs> how cute would that would have been oh my god that would have been so cute honestly like missed opportunity because at the concert you get those little like bracelets right like the little glow up like you know bracelets that go they like light up to the beat of the music but then this thing this little thing is gonna light up too so like how cool is that onto this forever and I'm also going to make this my new lanyard for my keys because I have um I have a lanyard on my keys right now I have a BTS one that I've been using for the last few months but I think I might have to swap it out for this because Taylor Swift Eras Tour VIP oh. I'm just oh, I'm so excited I haven't bought um any Eras Tour merch yet because I'm saving it because I want to buy it at the concert um, and it's so cool because as like a VIP I feel so weird saying that because it's like <laughs> I'm just like an average human but as a VIP of the show you get like early access into the stadium so you get to go in at like three o'clock and then you get access to like an exclusive store that's like inside where it's like a merch separate area for just the VIP so like you don't have to like stand out there with like the huge large crowds and like wait in the merch lines. Um, so that should be really nice. And I can't wait to get merch. Oh my god. I'm gonna be wearing the merch for the rest of my life. <laughs> Isn't that so cute though? Oh my god, I love this so much. I can't wait to use it. And then the last thing. last thing which first of all uh, how cute is this like i am obsessed with this box oh my god like how nice
different sounds when it's up. focus on this because you know I'm recording on my phone but it's trying on but oh, how cute is this oh my god it's so nice I want to like put this like on the lanyard well that'll be too heavy probably to wear all the time but oh my god it's just so cute I don't know if I love the sounds that this one is making though so I'm just gonna put this aside for now but like oh my god how adorable and how nice is that I don't know where I'm gonna put that now that I think about it um okay and then so reflective and it's like rainbow oh my god wow and then look at the back oh my god this is so beautiful oh my god and if you're wondering this is not uh, the exact like ticket that i got um because it says seat 13 row ts <laughs> and it has like just a bunch of 13s all over it Still, oh, how cute is this? Oh my god. In the back. I just like, I actually can't deal with how cute this is. Oh my god. It's so precious. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Like, I just wanna, maybe I'll pull it up on my bulletin board. Like, I don't know. It's so cute. So cute. Oh my god. Sorry. Just sorry about background noise. Uh, sorry about that. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> but there is a road right behind me and it's the middle. It's like pretty early in the night. So sorry about that. Anyways. Okay. Next thing is this. Which this is a really cool sticker. It's huge. It's huge. But it's a sticker. This also has all of the eras in order. Um, and I like that it's like tinted with like the colors of the era. So this one has the green and then like, you know, the gold yellow for fearless. And then, oh my God, dude, can these guys, can these guys quit it with their cars? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Anyways. Um, and then the last thing oh, are all of these postcards. There's postcards. They're like actual postcards. How cute is that? Like they actually have, you know, you can just put a stamp on it and like mail these out. Um, but there's postcards for every era. Aren't that, isn't that just so cute? Oh my God, look at this thing now. Oh, speak now, precious. Ooh, look at the one for red. Oh, that is so iconic, oh my God. Oh. That is such a look. Oh my god. I love her like kind of grungier look of reputation. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. Love her. Love her. Folklore. Folklore. Oh, evermore. And midnights. Midnights, midnights, midnights. Oh my god. Can you believe? Can you even believe? Um, oh, that would be so fun right now if I tried to 
name my top or my top three favorite songs from each era. <gasps> Ready? Okay. This era, it's definitely Should Have Said No. I think Should Have Said No is my favorite. This era, I think either the song Fearless or Forever and Always. Or, yeah, yeah, I think those are my favorites. Um, Speak Now. Oh my gosh. Well, these days, these days, it's Electric Touch and I Can See You. Oh my god, those are on repeat. Those are on repeat. But, um, Speak Now. I also love um, Sparks Fly and Enchanted and Back to December and Long Live. Oh my god, sorry. Um, okay, Red. I think my favorite song off of Red is All Too Well. Um, of course, like the 10 minute version. Also, Nothing New and I Bet You Think About Me and Holy Ground. Um, okay, 1989. My favorite songs are New Romantics, Clean, um, and then also um, You Are in Love and Wildest dreams. <laughs> uh, and then reputation. Oh my god. Uh, what is my favorite? I think delicate or dress are my favorite songs. Delicate or dress. And then also end game and dancing with our hands time. Lover era. Oh my god. Lover has maybe my favorite song of all time, which is the Archer. The Archer. The Archer. The Archer. Um, and then also Cruel Summer and Cornelia Street and False God. False God is criminally underrated. Uh, and folklore, folklore, folklore. My favorites for sure are This Is Me Trying, Mirrorball, and August. But also Peace. Stream Peace. Okay, next. Evermore. Evermore. Uh, uh, I think my favorite Evermore. It's gotta be Champagne Problems or Gold Rush or Cowboy Like Me. I can't choose. I can't choose. I can't choose. Okay, and then Midnight's. Midnight's for sure my number. lately it's been snow on the beach i've had snow on the beach on repeat a lot but also you're on your own kid you're on your own kid and lavender haze i really love lavender haze and antihero i don't know i love this album so much i love it midnight's so much so you'll have to let me know which taylor swift era is your favorite i would love to know and um i was gonna try to um posting a lot to my Instagram stories, which I'll have linked for my Instagram down below. And I'm also, I'm going to be posting a few days after the concert. Um, I'm going to be posting a vlog of my experience at the concert onto my other YouTube channel. Onto my other YouTube channel, which is called Gabby Reads, which will also be linked down below. so exciting so i can't wait for the concert thank you so much for watching let me know all of your favorite taylor things and i'll see you next time i'll see you next time all right bye